Hello and welcome to another fabulous date gaming video. This is as the lovely big title suggests, Space Base DF9. This is a little micromanagement game. Early access but I like it. So let's um... Let's before I actually accept so I just have to have one more. Let's talk about this a little. Basically the story behind this for people don't know and haven't looked at it. The um Earth's fucked. So the human race has to settle out across the Milky Way. Apparently. Which is a whole big galaxy we're in. So you start out, you choose your system. This get explains these quite nicely. Anyway, I'm going to take you through... Basically setting up the base. What time is it? So basically, um, I don't know what time it is. It is 5.49. That's probably fucking wrong. Research, um, no. Roster. Roster. First thing you do, two boulders. Well, actually, a tech station. Set him the boulder just to start. First thing you do is plan out like that small room is going to be that. Then I want a bigger room like that for. And then basically, you start out, you build these first two rooms. The one thing I'll have to say is a lot of these have short buttons. I wish up here at the speed controls had quick buttons. Like that's going to be life support. That's going to be an airlock. Oh, life support. Now, this is early access, so a lot of systems like Power and All haven't really been done yet. Basically, I, what I need to build now are space at lockers. Right, what's that matter? Oh, that's grand. And a couple of airlock doors. So this is a micromanagement game in which you set up a space station with some interesting systems for an early access game. Basically set up for survival, you start with food replicators and then you move to having a botanic spray, an aeroponics spray is probably the proper term but we'll let them away with it. All zones too. Basically, um, now they will take their space suits off, and I can start looking at doing other things. The third thing I highly recommend you build is you straighten this. This also gives you a wall to mount turrets on to protect your 
Please stay above 300. Object all on the door. And then this little ones. The one thing I have to say is a clicking is a little. It's a little vague in certain parts, like especially when you. I'll hopefully get to derelicts. It's 553. I'm hoping there and end this at like five, 5 past 6. Because Movie Maker's currently not working for me, so I need to run it through. Object. Refinery, minor refinery. Like this may not look like a stunning brace. If you're struggling for resources, you can break this down. Like nine times out of ten, I'll just do that. But I'm gonna keep this because I'm doing a video now. So roster, I don't need you on technician. But you're a good miner too, you fuck. And I need to start... So... Basically, you get two types of methods. You get pirate ones, which are obvious, or the obvious ones. In fact, they mimic real life quite well in that your airlock doors need a service. Please let us in so we can service it. Basically, your answer to that is fuck off. The other thing, once you get a bigger base, you can go back to Boulder because I'm not leaving someone who's only allowed one Boulder in that. So basically what you do now is, yes, that's one of the reasons I wish the speeds had quick controls. They probably do, I just haven't bothered looking them up. Just ball the outdoor walls first. So that's one of my little cons of that game. Like you can't when you set a job you can't really prioritize it. You also can't take manual control of the airlocks. Which really, really annoys me. You can't, like... Say I had raiders in here, and my... I just told my boulders to take that door down for self-defense. I can't go, right, shut you down. Right, duh, shut you down, duh, shut you down. Can't do it. Because then I would... Anyway, I'm going to come out and quickly say the next room you should build. It only needs to be that big. If I construct wall. I do like making them match up because it makes it easier for me later on. And uh, what the hell happened to my frame rate? There we go. 
Um. So now the builder will don its base it. The, there's a couple of niggles I have with this game. The one is you can't prioritize jobs. The second is if you're in an emergency mode, they will do, do fuck all. And um, one of the emergencies is under 30% oxygen. So if you have 30% oxygen, say your cyclers are busted so you tell them to bolt more. Nope. Nope, make nope, nope, nope. You have to be careful, some of those ones are pirates, some of them aren't. You get some transmissions like um airlock service man that are definitely like I've never gotten anything good out of clicking yes and them this is why I won't I'm going to explain this since you've seen them coming up even though that worked quite well that's why I would like manual airlock because I would make him wait until your other man's in because I've had boulders waiting on the airlock to repressurize that have choked because they've been they sat out a little too long building. Anyway, knock the speed up again. What time are we at? We are at six o'clock, so we have five minutes left. I know I don't usually do my videos at time, but this is Tuesday. I have plans. Yes, to go outside, that mystical thing outside the front door. So this game... It's 12 point, I believe. I will look at it now, before this video is over. But, if you're in the like, micromanagement, like example, a roller coaster tycoon or whatever, where you can be creative, but you like... For example, Minecraft, where there's an element of survival. This may be the game for you. But see if you don't like micromanagement and having to always worry about it. Oh, I can show the derelict system. I can't. Oh, they have a matter finally. They actually added a pretty nice system in a recent update. Is where if you ignored them, they would just stay there used to be. They fixed that in a recent update. Do I have anyone on a sign? You can be a miner actually. You can be a security. Anyway, research. But anyway, um, stop recommending that crap game, I'm not getting it. Sorry, Steam keeps recommending me, um, a little game called Sacra Spirit, which I haven't seen. I actually need to look up gameplay of it. I hate that! Can't you just... Um, object all zones. I want to actually do it first. You and you. I also hate that that they just walk into their lock because, um, it is nineteen point, well eighteen ninety nine in British monies. The first time I played this, just to warn you, if you place a beacon anywhere in your base, you'll sh your security. Which I can't show you at the moment. Because I don't have any 
Well, I do, but I want more than one boulder. And I want more than one miner. A bucket he can learn. Basically, um, your security do this. Is a certain boot? And then basically after you've claimed something Do you know what he's and also I like this system. I've told there has to be two security cards before entering that base. He is waiting outside that base for a second security card. Now this is what I mean. I should have it is f hard as hell for me to claim that. I'm going to unzone that because I don't like um, stray beds about. I might leave those matter refineries alone because they'll connect to my base somehow. Funny thing, that's another residential zone. That also means that's a little system I like if you're changing a area zoning. Any non essential items in that area will be re ordered for removal. I can't afford either of that. What? This is something I hate, it's the sleeping times. I wish you could turn those down in settings. They get on my wick so fucking much. But what's your talent? You're a boulder. So you get your ass over there and you take those beds apart. Well, anyway, I know this was pretty boring. I showed off the derelict system. I didn't show the raiders, I showed mining, I showed a basic setup. Like that base, what I would do is add more oxygen, then I would add... Let's see, what other rooms do I have? I'm going to actually look in... Well, first I would start researching, then I would construct object. I would construct next an infirmary, then maybe like a group resident zone, then a garden zone, then a pub. Pubs aren't like, um, pubs aren't like what I would think a pub. I'm an Irishman, I would think a pub as somewhere you go to get completely pissed. Yeah, that would be scary. Imagine someone waking up to someone with a pneumatic drill taking apart your bed. Or a sonic or whatever it is. Sonic screwdriver. Anyway. Anyway this is Space Base DF9. There will be a link in the description to this. It, I recommend if you like like micromanagement. Like for example. Theme Hospital. And those sorts of games. I don't recommend it if you don't like games like. Um, if you don't like those sorts of games. Maybe not the game for you. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. And enjoy the rest of your day. All zones, food replicator.
this is why I wish I could prioritize jobs. He's starving. Build a fucking thing. Why don't you just build it instead of bringing someone from another fucking base? Anyway, I will be doing the rest of the week. I'll just play it by ear. I have a lot of shit these next couple of weeks to get sorted. I'm moving house within a couple of months. So, thank you very much for watching again. I'm